What is Ramadan and its purpose? Was fasting started by Muslims? Did Jesus, peace be upon him, fast during Ramadan? What is Ramadan and its purpose? In English, fasting means to abstain from food or from certain kinds of food voluntarily as an observance of a holy day or as a token of grief, sorrow, or repentance. Ramadan is the ninth month of the Islamic calendar. It is a time of fasting for the Islamic people. Each day during this month, Muslims all over the world abstain from eating, drinking, as well as participating in anything that is ill-natured or excessive, from dawn until the sun sets. Fasting is intended to educate the Muslim in spirituality, humility, and patience. It is a time to cleanse the soul, focus attention on God, and put into practice selflessness. Was fasting started by Muslims? Well, God says in the Quran, O oh, you who believe, fasting has been ordained upon you as it was ordained upon those before you, in hope that you might be ever conscious of God. Therefore, this practice was not invented by current day Muslims. God had prescribed it to previous nations. For example, in Hinduism, fasting in Sanskrit is called Upavasa. Devout Hindus observe fasting on special occasions as a mark of respect to their faith or as a part of their penance. For Jews, the day Yom Kippur, the Day of Atonement, is the last of the ten days of repentance observed on the 10th of Tishri. It is forbidden on that day to eat, drink, wash, wear leather, or have sexual relations. It should also be noted that Moses, peace be upon him, is recorded in the Torah to have fasted and he was there with the Lord forty days and forty nights. He neither ate bread nor drank water. For Catholics among Christians, Lent is the major season of fasting, imitative of the forty-day fast of Jesus, peace be upon him. Jesus, peace be upon him, is recorded in the Gospels to have fasted like Moses. And he fasted forty days and forty nights, and afterward he was hungry. Did Jesus, peace be upon him, fast during Ramadan? According to many scholars, the translation reads, It has been ordained upon you as it was ordained upon those before you. Means, previous prophets fasted the month of Ramadan in timing and rituals. While fasting, Muslims abstain from eating and drinking. According to the Gospel of Luke, Jesus, peace be upon him, fasted as Muslims fast now. And it says, In those days he did not eat anything, and when they ended, he was hungry afterward. Muslims fast in specific days within the year, and Jesus, peace be upon him, recommended his disciples fast on specific days, as it states in this Bible verse, Then they will fast in those days. To Muslims, the ultimate goal of fasting is to attain consciousness of God. And this is what Jesus preached to his disciples. And he said, and your father who sees what you do in private will reward you. And the true followers of Jesus would do the same according to the Bible. If you continue in my word, then you are my disciples indeed. Afterward, the true followers of Jesus, peace be upon him, fasted. And it says they had fasted and prayed. During the month of Ramadan, Muslims pray and fast for 30 days. And true followers of Jesus did so as well. And it says, prayed with fasting. Today, Jesus, peace be upon him's true followers, are still fasting according to God's pure instructions. Muslims are the true followers of Jesus and all of God's messengers. God has intended one religion for humanity. As he says in his glorious Quran, Indeed, this your religion is one religion, and I am your Lord, so worship me. One God, one way of life, Islam. This is a sincere invitation to follow the religion of Jesus, Moses, and Muhammad. May peace be upon them all. And remember, if you have questions about Islam, ask a Muslim. Ask a Muslim. Ask a Muslim.